Hi there, Gary here from Longsons, and I'm going to take you on a brief video tour of this detached three bedroom bungalow we have situated in the popular, well serviced village of Necton in Norfolk. Okay, so we're now looking at the bungalow right in front of us. So, as you can see, we've got a, a really good sized driveway right in off-road parking for uh, several vehicles uh, driveway leading to the garage so the property does come with a single garage I'll, uh, uh, with, uh, that is divided with a temporary um, partition wall in the middle separating the front and rear of the garage that is temporary so if, um, if somebody wanted to open it out into one uh, full-size single garage again that wouldn't be uh, that be fairly straightforward so I've got low maintenance front garden uh, laid to shingle, shrubs and plants to beds and borders. And we've got gated access either side to the rear garden as well. So I'll just show you the property location. We're on Mason's Drive. Uh, it's just starting to rain. It doesn't rain here all the time. It's a popular development, uh, mainly bungalows. Um, I believe nearly all the uh, all the neighbouring properties are bungalows. Okay, well, let's go and head inside and have a look indoors. Let's get out of that rain. So we're straight into the entrance porch. We've got window either side and obviously the entrance door that we've just come in through. And then we've got the door through straight into the lounge. So that's a nice size lounge. You've got this feature stonework fireplace with an inset gas fire. This large panoramic style UPVC double glazed window to the front. So the property is UPVC double glazed throughout and it's also gas central heating as well. So continuing through the lounge, there's another door takes us into an inner hallway the doors off to the various rooms so we'll pop into the kitchen first that's a nice size kitchen with fitted kitchen units to wall and floor the stainless steel one and a half bowl sink units there's space for a large range style a gas stroke electric oven and hob with extract the hood over there's space and plumbing for a slimline dishwasher and space and plumbing for a washing machine. We've got space for a tall upright fridge stroke freezer. There's two built-in cupboards here. One of them to the, the one to the right is housing the uh, gas central heating boiler. The other one is a storage cupboard. There's also built-in cupboard just down the side here with double doors. Uh, that's got slatted shelving in and it is also housing the hot water cylinder as well. Got the entrance door opens to the side, provides access to the rear garden. I'll show you that in a moment. And we've got a window to the front as well. So heading back out the kitchen into the inner hall, we'll start with bedroom one. So, as you can see, double bedroom, good size window looking out to the rear garden. Bedroom two, again, a, a double bedroom. Window looking out to the rear garden. And then we've got bedroom three. Smaller of the three bedrooms, but still a good size bedroom. The window looking out to the side. And then across the opposite side of the hall, we've got a shower room. So we've got a double shower cubicle. We've got a wash basin set within a fitted cabinet. There's an obscure glass window to the side. And then we've got towel radiator, fully tiled walls. And then we've got next door to the shower room, a separate WC. 
with obscure glass window to the side. So let's head back into the kitchen. Out the entrance door to the side. Hope it stopped. Hope it stopped raining. And have a look at the rear garden. So uh, firstly, it hasn't stopped raining. It's still raining, but we've got gated access out to the front. We've got this uh, area to the side, a path down the side, which takes us out into the rear garden. So uh, as you can see, it's an enclosed rear garden laid to lawn. There's a large greenhouse just tucked away in the corner. Entrance door takes us into the garage. There's electric light and power in the garage as well. We've got electric lights to the rear of the bungalow. Gated access either side back out to the front. And there was also an outside tap down the side of the property as well. There's an area here just to the rear. It looks like it's been used for growing fruit and vegetables. Okay, so that was the brief video tour of this detached three bedroom bungalow we have available in the popular well-serviced village of Nickton in Norfolk. Thank you for watching.